Mr. Moose, I know that you and Ms. George both discussed the benefits of my bill in your testimony. Uh, could you expand on why you see it as important that the bill would make tribes directly eligible for federal funds to combat substance abuse? Thank you for the question. Um, I think one of the one of the probably the most important things that we talk about as tribal uh, program administrators and tribal providers is is getting direct funding. Uh, tribal leaders throughout Minnesota, Wisconsin, and Michigan uh, are always looking at uh, direct funding for their tribal programs. It helps us enhance the things that we currently do well, and it helps us target the things that we need. Uh, funding to to expand or to create access for so anything that's going to provide us uh, Sustainable funding for our tribal program something that we can we can change we can Redirect uh, based on how we see the need for our communities is critical to us addressing this issue Thank You mr. Moose um, Ms. George um it's really the same question to you. Uh, why do you see that my bill, this Mitigating Meth Act, as so important and beneficial? I think there are a couple of areas where um, we, we saw um, significant support here for us. Um, that really that it reflects the government-to-government -government relationship with the tribe, allowing the direct access. Mm -hmm. And also recognizing that um, grant funding limits our ability um, or creates a competition of resources between not just between tribes but even other local agencies that we work with and um, then we're often forced to choose between um, two very important issues or more very mm -hmm. important issues and sometimes don't get where we need to get. 